Good morning. It's been a while since I've posted a video, but I am here in Hong Kong. I moved to Hong Kong about four months ago, uh, which is crazy, and I'm yet to do a video, so this is my first one today. Um, I'm heading to Thai Mai Tuk uh, in the new territories of Hong Kong, which is uh, north of Kowloon, the main city. And uh, me and my friend Ken, we're going to go out there, do some cycling and see some of the natural beauty of uh, Hong Kong. I think the main thing for me really is to kind of see some of the natural stuff out there. Um, I've spent a lot of time in the city, obviously we're setting up since I've been here. And uh, as you may remember, my last video was in the Lake District and I really enjoy uh, what the natural world has to offer. So uh, we're going to go out up to the new territories and um, find some bikes and go see what's out there. So yeah, stay tuned and uh, I'm looking forward to the ride. Welcome back as well. Thank you for coming back and I hope you enjoy the video. Just made my way from Jordan to Admiralty Station. Mess up with Ken, Kenny boy. Let's Aiden, go. Ken. Yeah, let's go, man. Right, we're just getting the East Rail Line now to where are we going? What's it called again? Thai Mei Tuk. Thai Mei Tuk. Yeah, Thai Mei Tuk. There we go, Thai Mei Tuk. Let's say that again. Thai Mei Tuk. Thai Mei Tuk. Yeah, famous for cycling, for kayaking. Great scenes there. Brilliant. Well, this is what I said earlier. So the reason Ken's taking me over there because of the nice nature spots. And uh, yeah, we're gonna get some bikes and hopefully not fall off. <laughs> right, yeah, we're gonna head there now on the East Rail Line and we'll uh, catch you when we get there. made it to Taipo, the next stop on our destination. What we got to do next, Ken? Where are we off to now? So, well, firstly, we're going to get some fresh bakery. We're going to get, oh, mate, I haven't had breakfast, so that sounds like a plan. Yeah, pineapple with, like, butter inside, it's length. And then, we're yeah. going to go start cycling. All right, sounds, sounds good. Get a bus to the, to the cycle place. All right, what a nice little bakery. Yes. Mate, look at this, what a lovely little bakery. Mm. Oh. Yeah, look at chicken curry pie, mate. Oof. <laughs> mate, if you fancy a chicken tikka out here, mate, you've got to get it in a in a pastry. What what are we thinking? I don't know what to have, mate. Might just get a yeah, pineapple bun. Yeah, but you can get one with butter in. Um, right. you, see, these are famous here, right? These come yeah. from Hong Kong. Yeah. Yeah, these are really nice. It hasn't actually got pineapple in. It's just like the top of it looks like a pineapple. So you might get one of these. Oh, we see it. Yeah, and it's very faint. They normally put like sticks of butter in. Yeah. Amazing for your health. Amazing. Absolutely amazing for yeah. your health. Definitely um, won't get any diseases one of them <laughs> if I eat two. <laughs> nah, there's only two left. Oh, true, you get one. Yeah. Hello. Hi. Can I get this, please? Eight fifty. Eight fifty. Can I pay for cash? Ah, I'm going to say. Uh, sending file up. Sending file up. Uh, sending file up. Bye bye. Bye. Oh, we just got some bakery products, man. It's gone and uh, there's no Greggs, unfortunately. That's the one thing about Hong Kong. They've got a pret a manger, but not a Greggs. So it's not ideal, to be honest with you. But yeah, gonna have a sit down, try some food. Ken has also so nicely has bought me, and I don't have to pay him back, a pork floss bun. But yeah, we're just gonna eat our breakfast and then get the bus over to, where are we going again? Uh, Thai Mei Tuk. Thai Mei, what Thai Mei? Bloody hell. Am I getting up there? Bro, what do you think I am? I'm a circus performer. I can't get up there. Nah. Oh, nah, bro, what the? Oh my God. <laughs> I nearly fell over. Mate, what is this total white paint? Jesus Christ. Parkour. Oh, I'm stuck. Ken, I'm stuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there we go. I'm in. Bloody hell. Uh, we've got to hop the fence as well. Say that again. We're going to hop the fence. Dude, no, man. Come on. Well, we're going to go find somewhere to sit so we can eat. 
while he's doing Takeshi's Castle. <laughs> well, we've got our beautiful baked goods from Hong Kong Greg's. This is that pork floss I was talking about. Look at the top of that. Look how nice that is. It's like spicy pork candy floss and um, some kind of... What have you got, Ken? What you got there? No, I picked that up. You must have picked that up, mate. That wasn't me. This is some kind of ham and cheese bun. Look at that. You got that nice plastic cheese on the bottom of that. And a famous egg tart. Mm -hmm. Egg tart. I'll have to try one of them one of the days. But today I'm sticking with my, my bun, my pineapple bun and my pork floss. Let's have a go on this. Is it spicy? Have you tried it? Not tried it. Not tried it. I'm interested in this. It's not candy floss, isn't it? It's weird. It's nice. probably it's probably one of the weirdest things in in Asia, but it's it's nice. It uh, it looks nice. Anyway, let's give it a go. That's all right, you know. The texture's kind of like soft. Mmm. It's a bit. It's a bit like having to chew it, yeah. <laughs> like a wine gum, mate. That tastes like pork. I'll finish the rest of this up and then, um, yeah, we're gonna head on the bus, go over to, what was the name again? Time Ate Up. Time Ate Up. <laughs> For the fourth time. For the fourth time. Apparently it's a beautiful reservoir there, a nice little temple, so we're gonna go check that out, hire some bikes and, um, yeah, go and have a lovely day. Is this the bicycle shop here? Yeah, just, just there, literally. Oh, sound. I always go Real. to this old lady, she's right now. Oh, lovely. Oh, wow, look at this. Mate, this is lovely, man. This this reminds me of like Spain or something, you know? Yeah. Yeah, this is weird. Little village. Wow. I think the masks will start to come off soon as well. I hope so, I hope so. Let's get a drink first. Yeah, sounds good to me, mate. Look at these little little bikes. Oh, these are funky, man. I've not been here. Look how sick that is over there. Look at these little guys over here. Yeah. Crazy. Is this where we get the bikes? Drink. Oh, a drink. Oh, look at this little guy. Leho. Oh, he's so cute. Hello. Oh, yeah. Right. Leho. Oh, look at this little guy. Hello. His master. Oh, is that his oh, boss? Yeah. Boss man? Is that yeah. boss man out there? Yeah, he knows. He's running off. <laughs> well, I'm Look, just. A, have you seen that before? Chopper chips. They're lollipops, aren't it? Yeah. They, uh... Oh wow. They look fancy. I'm just gonna get me some water, mate. Like I'm gonna get some water. Oh, I'm coffee. Yeah. Caffeine yeah. added. Yeah. Like some, some water. Oh. Okay. That's a yeah. Separate. Yeah. If you get my drink, then you don't. Oh have yeah, to... yeah. I'll get. I'll get. I'll get them. I'll get them. Okay. Thank you. See you next time. See you next time. Go say, send you a file up. Bye bye. Bye, little man. What, what a lovely little dog, man. Oh, here we are. Right, we're at the bike shop. Ken, this one for you here, mate. This one, yeah? Come on, mate. Right. For, for, for him. This one, yeah? For him. Yeah, this one, yeah? Yeah. For... Go on, Ken. Go on, it. Go on. Yeah? Uh, if you can do it, it will be free, just say. <laughs> if you could do it for free. <laughs> Ken, let's have a go. If you break the woman's come thing. Come on, then. <laughs> come back, I can't even get my legs up. <laughs> Anyone, yeah? Anyone. Hello. Yeah, Hello. Hi, I'm fine. Wow, you've got a very nice shop. Yeah, yeah. Very nice shop, yeah? yeah? Yeah, you're gonna get mate. I want one with a little bass, little pink basket on. Yeah, the basket costs yeah. ten dollars. Do you have big, 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 big? Oh, bro, over here. Wow, look at these ones. What are these? Oh, these are much better. There we go. These are better. Here we go. Big boy bikes. Oh, I think I'll take this one, love. This one's lovely. It's all right, this. Ah, I'm going to say. Ah, lovely. What well, if the basket flies off, mate? That's the only problem. Ah, there we go. That's how you're tying it on. Oh, brill, there we go. Look at this, Ken. Going on a little journey, mate. Thank you very much. See you later. Have a lovely day.
Ken! Ken on a motorcycle. Come on, lad. Wow. You're taking ages here. Come on. Oi, slow coach. Ah. Mate, this is beautiful. Where are we going? Left or right? Straight. Mate, look how lovely this is. Leho. Oh. Leho. Hello, little dog. Hello. He said hello to me, lad. Yeah, he did. He loved it. This is the barbecue pit. Oh, mate, look at that. The kayaking's over there. Mate. Oh, lad, you got some sausages for me? Cheers, man. I'll come back from later. Come up, dog. Oh, mate, this is lovely, this. I feel like Lance Armstrong, just without the drugs. Look at how phenomenal that is. Wow. Ken. Mate. What's going on? Where are we, lad? This is peng. This is amazing. Emma's got the kites. Someone's doing a bit of fishing there. Catch me my dinner. Cheers, lad. Sunning Philog. Sunning Philog. Am I saying that right? Yeah, you are. Why is no one replying? Why? Why are you doing Sunning Philog? Yeah, my guy. Yes, Donny. Oh, look at that dog. Sunning Philog dog. <laughs> Hello. Hello, my friends. I feel like Phileas Fogg, mate. Phileas Fogg. Where, where, where's my air balloon, lad? <laughs> mate, I got a, a, a wasp or something just licked my nostril. Goodness me. Sunning fire, look. Yeah, for those of you who don't know, that means Happy New Year. Bit of Cantonese, that. Mate, I'm a multicultural man. I don't know what's floating my mouth, mate, but that's... Goodness me. That is phenomenal. I mean, I'm, I know I'm joking around a bit, but that is amazing. Wow. Ken, what a shout. What a lovely place to be. You know what I mean? I could be back home in the UK. Don't get me wrong, I love the UK, but... I tell you now, New Year's Eve back there, be freezing cold, be in your jumper, and look, I'm in, I'm in my, my T-shirt, on a bike, in Hong Kong, amazing. See, this is what I mean when, like, Hong Kong, you can just go from the city, go for, like, 40, 40 minutes to an hour on the MTR, which is their metro, and a bus, and you can end up in some beautiful places like this. Amazing, absolutely amazing. And look at that, the mountains and everything. Do you know what I mean? And like, if you, if you look at some of the places around Hong Kong, especially in Kowloon or on the island, it's, it's densely populated. A lot of buildings, it's, it's, you know what I mean? A lot of people. When you come to here and you've just got nature. Nature. Hello. Which is absolutely amazing. And I tell you now, this is why I'm here. And a little bit for the food as well. But I'm mainly here for these beautiful views. Ah, Sonny and Philo. He loves it. He absolutely loves it, mate. <laughs> oh, come on, slow poke. What's going on here, lad? What's going on here, lad? What's going on here? Come on, then. Come on, then. Come on, then. You want some? <laughs> I'll give you. <laughs> well, yeah, since being here for four months, I mean, it's kind of weak because I came here three years ago. Um, three, yeah, three, four years ago I came with, uh, with university. Yeah, but not this exact location. But not, no, no, not, not this exact location. Um, but I came to Hong Kong and, mate, I didn't even leave the city. Ah, Leho! Whereas now, this is, do you know what I mean? Coming out here, seeing all this type of stuff, it, it makes you think what I missed, do you know what I mean? But I'm here now, I'm here now. Wow. We're coming to the end of the road now. Oh, speed bump! Oh. Coming to the end of the road now. That's it, Ken. We're going home now, yeah? We, you can't go anywhere else. We've got, um, so what? We have, do we actually have to turn back? Yeah, 
<laughs> oh, lovely. I'll do that again, though. That was lovely. That was lovely. Where are we going next? Uh, so we go back and then we go to the temple. Ah, bro. So we're going to loop back round, get back down that reservoir, and then we're, yeah, we're going to get to the temple. Right, we're gonna get some food. Ken's recommended this place. Got like these little curried fish balls, and uh, I don't normally eat fish, so this will be this will be interesting. It'll be interesting. You, he saved you, right? Yeah, he helped me. He saved him from the water. He said you saved him. Yeah. Good man. Good man. Good man. Food and water. How nice. And this is where I rent the kayaks. Oh, and this is where the kayaks are. Oh, brilliant. Okay. Well, let's get some scram then, man. Oh wow, these are fish balls here. Can I have a uh, six please? Uh, yes. Uh, uh, curry, curry, curry fish ball please. Enjoy. And have you got the, the sausage, the cheese sausage? Yes, that as well please. They look tasty. Whole sick. Whole sick, whole sick. Go on, get some of that in there. Say again. Ah, go Thai. Bro, got some fish balls. Mate, I'm not gonna, I don't like fish. I'm not the biggest fan of fish. So this is gonna be interesting. This is gonna be interesting. Are they nice? They're all right. They're all right. I'm not the biggest fan of fish balls as well. Stood for the games. They're not bad, you know. Yeah? Yeah, they're all right. They're not too fishy. I was expecting them to be fishy. I hate things that no. are fishy. They're, they're quite nice. It's the texture of mostly. That's like. Yeah, but the, the texture, I don't mind it. It's like a normal meatball, man. I was expecting it to be flaky. No, it's quite nice. Mm. Bit of chilli sauce. It's alright, that. You got some cheese sausage. Sausage with cheese. Smells of cheese. Is that good? It's a good point. I think it's infused, mate. They're nice. The sausages are definitely nicer. Do you want one? I'm not nice. You're right. They're nice, man. Yeah. That's all right, that. Huh? I definitely recommend. Right, I'm going to finish these off and then we're going to uh, head over to the temple. Bro. Ah. Thank you. Hello. Can I just say, come here. The food is very nice, yeah? And this gentleman, what is your name? Uh, John. 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 He saved, he saved my friend Ken's life. Thank you, John. Thank you. Thank you. Good people, very nice here, yeah. very nice food. Thank you, see you later. Send you in look, bye bye. Right, we're finished with food. We've uh, said hello to Ken Saviors. Mm -hmm. Help us. And now, uh, I'm gonna give it too much credit. <laughs> give it to help us, yeah. And then we're gonna go over. You can just about see it here. That up there, that statue, the white statue off in the distance, right? And we're heading there now. And it is huge, absolutely huge. Right, let's go. Let's get back on the bikes. Back on the trusty steed, huh? The hill steep, but you can just about see at the top there the bit of white popping out from the trees. That's the big gal, the big gal, the big uh, the big Buddha statue. Oh man, Ken, what are you leaving me for? <laughs> but yeah, we're nearly there now. But it looks amazing from over there where we saw it earlier. It looks absolutely amazing. But I didn't bring any sun cream, so I'm a little bit red. So uh, I might look like a lobster on the way back. It's all right, many seafood restaurants in Hong Kong. So I'm, uh, I'm sure they'll make use of me. <laughs> Whew. Oh, so Ken knows a little bit more about this, uh, this statue than I do. So who was he built by? It was built by a guy called Lei Ga Sing. He's the richest man in Hong Kong. Billionaire, ah. billionaire businessman. Billionaire businessman. I was just saying down there, I don't know many billionaires back home building 
massive statues. True, true, yeah. <laughs> so what's it a statue of? It's a statue of a lady called Guan Yin. Guan Yin. Just as uh, to the same level of popularity as Buddha himself. Oh wow. Guan Yin means um, the name literally translates as all perceiving sound. So if you're crying, even if you're alone, she will hear you and she'll come and help you. Oh wow. Yep. That's quite nice, isn't it? Everybody worships her in all households. So is this like, would it be worshipped to the same level of, as Buddha himself then? Yeah. 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 She's the most compassionate being in the religion. Wow. That's so. beautiful. Yep. So Guan Yin. Guan Yin. Yep. Guan Yin. So if you're ever in need, pray to Guan Yin. Pray to Guan Yin. She will, uh, she will listen. That's a lovely sentiment. Yep. Right. We're going to head up because I can't hold this any longer. And then we'll get to the top. We'll show you the statue. Right, so we just made it top. You see in the background there, the big statue. That is immense. Wow. And this is the monastery. What's the monastery called again? Again. Sing Sansi. Sing Sansi. Sing Sansi Monastery. That's amazing. You've got the big statue in the background. There's a month waiting list to get into here. A month. Yeah, we didn't book in advance, so we're not, we can't get in there, but just seeing it from here is absolutely beautiful. I tried getting in a month ago, sold out, 8am I was on the online trying to book it. Was it? Wow. That is immense. That is crazy. It's so, it's like there's no noise either, it's so tranquil. And her face, the face of tranquility, compassion, purity. That is crazy. And I believe that ball that she's holding yeah. represents eternity. But I could be wrong. Well, either way, mate, I feel like you've you've really, really described it beautifully, whether it's right or wrong. Yeah. <laughs> that is amazing. It's a beautiful thing. It's not difficult to describe it beautifully. It's a shame you can't get in. Right, so we did we did try and blag our way in a bit. <laughs> but yeah, no, we were like saying like, oh, can we just come in for 10 minutes or something? But no, it's like, it's really strict really strict there's no way but i suppose at least we get to see it here and maybe in a few months i'll come back and and do a video inside but it's uh it's absolutely beautiful absolutely beautiful he says that there's a, something that we can there's another temple down there at the bottom okay hill. we turn right and it's like 300 400 years old so oh wow yeah let's go and have a look at that we can go and have a look at that junior 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 that's beautiful Ah, sunny file up. Oh, I'm going to say. Bro, right, so let's go and check that out then, yeah? Yeah. But how beautiful is that? That is absolutely beautiful. Glorious. You absolutely can see beautiful. On, the, on the forehead as well, at the, at the very top. That's yeah. Buddha himself on the forehead. Oh, wow. You see? Yeah, just at the top up there. Yeah. Mate, that is immense. That is absolutely immense, especially with the mountain as the backdrop. That is beautiful. The folding of the clothes as well, like the scarf, mm. really, really nicely done. Yeah. Definitely a, a lot of effort's gone into that. Yeah. Wow. Right. Yeah, we're gonna go head down, go yeah. to this temple. Oh, and then uh, we'll zip, we'll zip down, we'll zip, we'll zip down, down, we'll zip down, we'll zip down here and then we'll go to that temple. That's a shame, but absolutely beautiful. Oh, yeah, let's go. Oh. Good. Yeah, boy. little temple at the bottom. Look at this little guy. Look at this little man. Alejo. Hello little man. Hello. Hello. Little guy. Little guy. Oh, so yeah we made it to this little temple. How nice is this? So we didn't get to go at the one at the top but at least there's this little one here. Yeah. 300, years old. 300 years old. Wow. I mean it looks it looks a bit newer than that mate I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Maybe, maybe, uh, maybe a bit of a trip to B and Q was in order for him a few years ago. Ah, oh, right, I said in.
But that was a beautiful experience in there. I'll tell you now, very spiritual and very nice. And I'll tell you when you're sitting there praying, um, you definitely get a sense of peace. It's lovely and it's, it almost kind of sounds a little bit, do you know what I mean? What are you on about, lad? But no, it is, it is actually lovely, nice and peaceful. Very nice in there. But I think that's a lovely end, a lovely end to the video. And uh, I've really enjoyed the trip. And thank you, Ken. Thank you for bringing me, mate. It's absolutely, yeah, thank you. Well, no, thank you for bringing me, mate. It's absolutely beautiful. But I think that was a perfect end to the video. Uh, it's a shame we couldn't go up to the monastery itself, but that's always uh, something for another time, right? But yeah, I've really enjoyed it. Nice trip. And this is why I came to Hong Kong for, was to experience stuff like this, um, being able to see. Um, beautiful places like the temples and all the kind of spiritual things because obviously you see the big city but you don't really see this type of thing so yeah but I hope you've really enjoyed thank you for joining me back again it's been so long but I'm back again I'm back here in uh, on YouTube and uh, looking forward to exploring more of Hong Kong so join me next time um, where I explore more of what Hong Kong has to offer I look forward to it see you later bye bye